We are taking Scrappy on a walk. South side. South side of Austin. River is right here. What more could you want? Coffee. Taking Scrappy down to this like walk along the river because it's super pretty and also I don't know. It's not a hundred it, degrees. It's not a hundred <laughs> degrees outside. Also we know it's been like a year and a half since we posted. We will talk about that. We're trying to train him with treats. Not working too well here. What the heck? He just looped around me twice. What is he doing? <laughs> what? You got you. He just Why keeps is he going. Doing that? He just... You're, you're stuck now. Here, you want this? Come here, buddy. Good boy. Come here. Good boy. Yes. And this is why we love walking this path. So, this is the city. And there's Scrappy. And we just walk along this path. Sometimes you'll see people rowing out here. It's kind of interesting. You come early enough. Yeah, we're really late today. It's already like 12.30. And then usually right here is where we turn around because Scrappy can't really go that far. And he's doing whatever this is. Okay, so a lot of stuff has changed in the past year and a half that we have not made videos. So we're gonna catch you up on everything very quickly that has changed so we can get on with the video. We moved into a new apartment that is very messy right now. You say don't show that? <laughs> Scrappy's still here though. Okay, louder. I invested in an espresso machine uh, that we use a lot at home and I take to events in the Austin area. I started trying to learn how to play guitar. I'm very bad at it, but I, I'm learning. And then Haley started doing mobile coffee events with her machine, so this is like her stuff to do a mobile event. And I think that's really it. A lot of stuff has changed in small ways, but a lot of stuff has changed in big ways. We decided we want to start making videos again because we were, well, Haley was watching back our videos and saw how cool it was to document everything, so we're back. Ma'am? Yes? What's she doing? Making a latte and a pumpkin. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're never. Are you tired? You're. Are you pooped? What's wrong with you? Hello. Mm, mm, mm. Homemade pizzas. Okay, Haley is going to pour a coffee into a pumpkin for her Instagram. This is like a really nice espresso machine, actually. It's like, like not like a, uh, what would you call us? Like you actually pull shots. You have to do like the right grind size. It's like, it's like an actual espresso machine that can serve at a coffee shop if you wanted to but we have it in our apartments. Heck yeah. <laughs> Pulling a shot. Ready? Yes. All right. Okay, wait. Uh, okay. Say action. Action. Oh no. <laughs> that did not work, oh no. Oh no, wait, try again, try again. <laughs> Okay, it's round two. Such a small pump. Okay, wait, oh, go. Oh, God. There you go. Wasn't as good as last year's, but it's something. It's a heart. Okay, so now for the main part of the, uh, the episode, the vlog or whatever, we are at this, like, outdoor art area creative space because Haley has smoke grenades in that like cauldron thing I have my camera Those the, can't see them on the camera right now but we've been taking like Halloween pictures with these smoke grenades every year so we're gonna do them here somewhere we don't know where yet oh it's not focusing focus on Haley 
Okay, so we're gonna take pictures of Haley with her cauldron. We're gonna do, <laughs> I think we're gonna do one over here first. So we're gonna do one set up here and then one probably here. And these are the smoke grenades we're using. These wire pole smoke, smoke things from Enola Gay. These only last like 30 seconds, but all of our pictures that we've ever done with smoke has been with those, so we're just sticking with them. The most stressful part is getting everything right because if the camera settings aren't right, the smoke only lasts 30 seconds and then you're kind of out of luck. And these things are like $10 per smoke grenade, so we only bought two. <laughs> the first uh, smoke grenade we're gonna do the white one first because I think the white one's gonna be like a little less fun than the red one so to make sure we get it right testing with the white one I'm gonna put the camera down and just like let it record that and I'm gonna try to do this Is that that's on okay so come over here. okay here we go ready Number <laughs> number one done. This is the the aftermath. Um, kind of burnt a little bit, but you know. Freaked me out. How do you think it went? I don't know. Did I look terrified? No, you actually looked really good. I was using the pole as kind of like a frame. I'll post some pictures on the thing in a second. So that was number one. I'll try to look less terrified. So this is the aftermath of the bucket. Uh, let me turn up the brightness here a little bit. So, as you can see, we kind of burnt, you know, a hole in the side of the bucket. <laughs> Did it get hot? Was it, like, hot on your hand? Um, I was holding the handle, so I didn't feel it get hot, but I definitely noticed. <laughs> that it was, like, melting yeah. it? It looks good. Yeah. Okay, we're going to do round two. Round two is with the red one. Red smoke grenade, so we're gonna do it in the same spot and then I'm gonna have her run over and sit on this one to hopefully get a few shots on this bench as well. Hopefully that works with timing wise though. And our bucket doesn't melt. And our bucket doesn't melt. Cause that's a, that's a possibility. Actually, you need this. like a delinquent right now. <laughs> We're gonna come get arrested. <laughs> it is always sketchy setting off like smoke grenades because I mean technically we're allowed there's no like rule against it but like like a fire ban or something maybe I don't know. It's always a little bit a little bit sketchy. We should always get Okay, so we're leaving the place delinquents, uh, running away from the police as they are actively coming to search for us. <laughs> um, I think it went really well. The It's always hard because they're expensive. They're, it's $10 per smoke grenade and you have to order them so you can't even just like go get more. But yeah, I think they look good. We're gonna go home. I'm gonna edit some of them and post them in this video so you can actually see it. What did you think? How was your experience? I am typically not comfortable in front of the camera 
in things like that, like staged like photo shoot setting. So it always takes a minute to like warm up and not feel awkward, but you don't really have time with these. Yeah. So hopefully it's like a 30 second normal. shoot. It's like a 30 second shoot total for each grenade. Oh, yeah. Okay, we're going home. We've inhaled so much smoke. It smells so bad. We're driving with the windows down because we're dying. Last order of business for the day is we're gonna to go to Fly Right, which is apparently is a chicken place that I've never been to. Chicken sandwiches. So we're gonna get some food. Hello, Fly Right. Okay, we got our little spooky lanterns lit. Our chicken sandwiches. Gonna watch a movie and sign off. Well, we can't yet because I gotta edit the pictures, so I gotta show those tomorrow. Then we'll sign off.